Hi, Michelle Loveday here. I'm founder of Rise Virtual Academy and I own Loveday Educational Consulting. I've gotten the question, why do we even need to celebrate Black History Month? Well, I have an answer for that. Why shouldn't we celebrate Black History Month? Black history has often been times repressed, omitted, and revised in our American textbooks that so much is being left out that this was a way that we could honor and recognize the contributions that people from the African diaspora have contributed to our society. Black history is American history, but we should be careful to remind ourselves that Black history is world history. Did you know that Black History Month is not only celebrated in the United States, but in Canada as well in the month of February? In Ireland, the Netherlands, and the United Kingdom, Black History Month is celebrated in the month of October. It's so important to highlight the contributions that Black people have made and the diaspora that we all come from. Black people speak Spanish, French, and many other languages, and their contributions to world and American society have been vast. And Black history is not just for Black people. Everyone, all people should learn the contributions about Black people in this society. It's important to highlight so that not only do we talk about the contributions, but we discuss the issues of race that are at hand. I always like to say that if we don't learn from our past, we will be forced to repeat it. And so it's important that we not only look through what happened from slavery to civil rights, but we look at the celebrations and the amazing contributions that Black people have given. We hope that you take the time to look up the literature, the authors, the musicians from the Harlem Renaissance, and the contributions during the 1920 that have shifted the music that we have today. We encourage you to look at all of the authors, the writers, the dancers from the 1950s, 60s, and 70s during the Motown era and their contributions to how music has shifted. You will be wowed at the perspectives that are given during the time when we were going to war and the Black people that contributed and helped during those efforts. Many women who helped get women's rights to vote in 1913 were also black women who knew that they didn't have the right to vote, but they saw a vision of hope for black people. Our history is rich and we encourage you to explore it and to tie it into everything else that you have learned. Happy Black History Month.